The Beaumont Public Library System presents Hi everyone, this is Beaumont Public Library System story time. I'm Miss Robin and it's time for me to read one of my favorite stories. And today I'm going to read a silly bedtime story. It's called, Let's Sing a Lullaby with the Brave Cowboy. It's by Jan Thomas. She's one of my favorite authors and illustrators too. It's time to hit the hay, little cows. It's time for little cows to rest their heads. It's time for little cows to go to bed. It's time for little cows to sleep so tight. It's time for us to say, eek. Hmm, I wonder what happened. Is that a huge hairy spider over there? Does that look like a spider to you? Maybe a little bit. It's just a flower, cowboy. Oh. Hmm. Well, let's try that lullaby again, shall we? It's time for little cows to rest their heads. It's time for little cows to go to bed. It's time for little cows to sleep so tight, it's time for us to say, eek. Hmm, wonder what it is this time. Is that a slimy, slithering snake right there? Does that look like a snake to you? What do you think it is? It's just a stick, cowboy. Oh. But is there a large lumbering bear behind me? Does that look like a bear? Sort of. It's just me, cowboy. Oh. Hmm. Oh, I see how this works. It may look like a huge, shaggy, gray wolf over there. Grr, grr. And it may sound like one too. Eek! But it's probably just a big, giant bunny rabbit, right? No, cowboy. It's a wolf. Um, do wolves like lullabies? Like them? We love them. Well, alrighty then. It's time for us to rest our heads. It's time for us to go to bed. It's time for us to sleep so tight. It's time for us to say good night. The end of Let's Sing a Lullaby with the Brave Cowboy. I don't think he was as brave as he thought he was, but that's okay. Sometimes we see things and can't tell what they are, but if we take a second look, we found out, find out that they're not so scary after all. Well, thanks for joining me for Miss Robin's Favorite Stories. I hope you'll come back again. Mm -hmm.